with me are the delightful, quiet, shy, retiring, and very sophisticated brothers Hanson. Hello. Hello. Hey. Uh, how has fame changed your lives? We're basically the same people as we were before. We haven't really changed. It's more the way people look at us and the way people, you know, perceive act to you. you. I mean, really, I mean, we've. We a lot of things have changed. You know, we've gotten to see the world. We've performed yeah. for thousands and thousands of people now, and seen just so many different things. So in that way, a lot of things have changed. But, but as as, as people, people yeah. we're the same people we always right. were. Right. Who are your music influences? We were very largely influenced by fifties and sixties rock and roll, like Chuck Berry, Johnny Taylor, Otis, Otis Redding, Redding, Elvis, 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 Elvis the, Beatles. the Beatles, the Beach Boys. You know, all that stuff. It's just great music, and that was our strongest inspiration. It was really just because when we went to South America for a year, we got this tape from 1958, and then that had songs like that. Well, you know, there was no English radio, so we were listening right. to 50s rock and roll. What were the main obstacles you had to overcome to achieve success? You know, we've been extremely lucky. The success that we've had and at, the opportunity. Such a young, at yeah. such a young age. Great. And, uh, because, you know... We did it for six years, and then you know you get signed, and then the work starts, and it's people think when you sign the record contract, it gets easy, but it actually gets harder. But there are so many people, so many that, other bands, you know, that have worked twice as long as we have all their lives, and maybe never gotten this opportunity. So we're just really lucky to have been yeah. able to have the whole world get to hear the music. Do you find that there are people that are older sometimes don't take you seriously because you're you're young guys. Well, you know, obviously we are young, so there's yeah. there's a million musicians that are way better than we are. It's really just about, you know, we take what we do very seriously because we, we love to make music, yeah. and we write our songs, and we play our songs, and we sing all the songs, and we're very strongly into the production side of it, too. So we what, we do, the what we do is, yeah, yeah, what we do is the real thing. And I can understand their skepticism. I can understand why they would be reluctant. And I, I guess you could say you kind of have to prove yourself to them, but the truth is, the truth no. will shine through. Yeah, yeah. When you see we really do do it. Are you going to do a world tour? Oh, yes, definitely. That's one thing that we're really looking forward to. Not only just the fun for us, but that there's so many people that are looking forward to yeah. just yeah. being going to a concert. So, so we this, just we yeah. can't wait. How would you describe Pepsi? You know, Pepsi has always had a, a very cool image. Like, it's always been with the times, you know. It's always been very forward-moving. You know, now it's Generation Next because Pepsi has always been kind of hip and into whatever is happening now and moving forward to the future. And that's kind of what you think of Pepsi as. Now, aside from making music, what other interests and aspirations do you have? Well, I mean, we basically all like to do the same kind of stuff. We all like to draw. We'd like to play soccer, what you guys call football. Okay. I mean, we, we do a lot of things. I mean, obviously music is the main focus, but, you know, making movies, writing songs for other people, producing our own records and maybe other people's records, those are all things that we would like to do in the future. So in the future, yeah. but now I think this is, this is by far the focus, doing music. Yeah, sure. Have you yeah. ever considered making, a, like, a, the Hanson movie? I think music is really the important thing. Doing movies and things like that could be really cool. It's just because we like to be involved in anything we do, you know, we would want to be involved in the yeah. script and in everything. So we need, we need plenty of time to make a good movie. So things like that are just in the future.